Young workers with the Green City Force, who are part of the Federal AmeriCorps program, harvesting kale and basil from an urban farm in Canarsie, then packing it up for delivery to a food pantry. A lot of people uh, love what we did here, and, you know, they always come in here with a smile on their face. The farm at the Bayview Houses is one of three up and running at NYCHA housing developments, with two more on the way. It's part of Mayor de Blasio's Building Healthy Communities initiative. The public-private partnership seeks to improve health and safety in 12 of the city's neediest neighborhoods. By increasing opportunities for physical activity, uh, increasing access to healthy foods, and promoting public safety. Other aspects of the plan include constructing 50 new soccer fields, announced this summer, and expanding the Shape Up NYC fitness program, with newly trained Spanish language instructors. We'll be rolling that out through our 12 neighborhoods that, that want it, and that's a key component. The neighborhood, we're working with each neighborhood to determine what they want. At Bayview Farms, two acres of largely unused fenced off space was transformed into a bounty of fresh produce, distributed free to residents who bring compost items or volunteer working here. NYCHA community leader Cheryl Boyce says at first it was a tough sell to residents, but no longer. They started to do this one and see how big it, how, how big it is and, and um, the benefits that it's bringing to the residents here. Then I was, yep, this program is a great program. It was amazing, the progress from how we started until where we are now. The Green City Forest Corps members who work here at Bayview are also NYCHA residents, and they say they certainly wouldn't mind seeing something like this in their community. I'm planning on creating my own garden after this and trying to grow different things. And it's, it's great to know that you're eating something that's coming from the earth and not coming from like the supermarket or from across the world. And after just about a month in operation, the farm has already distributed 775 pounds of produce to residents here, with more to come during the current harvest. In Brooklyn, Roger Clark, New York One.